Hello everyone, I'm Albert Bevy with Spain on a Fork. Today we're making a special treat, homemade fig bread. Now, traditional recipes for this bread call for the use of dried figs. However, it's fig season right now, so I'm gonna be using some fresh figs. This bread is super moist and it's not too sweet, making it an ideal treat for breakfast or with afternoon tea. This is a quick recipe and it's easy to make. If this is your first time watching my channel, I encourage you to click on that subscribe button. If you're already a subscriber, welcome back. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is preheat our oven. We're gonna put it in the bake only option and we're gonna hit it at 170 degrees Celsius, which is about 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Now let's grab a small nonstick frying pan, let's heat it with a medium heat, and let's dry roast a quarter cup of blanched almonds between three to four minutes. Now comes the star of the show, fresh figs. Let's grab six of them, let's cut off both ends, let's finely chop them and add them to a mortar. Now let's add a quarter cup of walnuts and three cloves to the mortar. Now let's grab our quarter cup of toasted almonds, let's add them to the mortar, and let's mash everything together until we form a thick puree. Once you have a thick and chunky puree, let's add two tablespoons of organic honey, two tablespoons of extra virgin Spanish olive oil, and let's mix everything together. Okay, next let's grab one cup of all-purpose flour and let's add it to a bowl. Now let's add a generous teaspoon of baking powder, two tablespoons of white sugar, and let's mix it together. Now let's add our thick mixture into the bowl. Okay, for our final ingredients, let's add a quarter cup of oat milk, a pinch of sea salt, and let's mix everything together until it's well mixed. Now let's grease a two by six inch bread pan with some extra virgin Spanish olive oil. Now let's evenly distribute our bread mixture into the bread pan and let's add it to the oven for exactly 30 minutes. Okay, it's been exactly 30 minutes since we added our fig bread to the oven. Let's go ahead and take it out and let it rest at room temperature for about 15 minutes. Okay, it's been about 20 minutes since we took our fig bread out of the oven. Let's go ahead and remove it from the bread pan and add it to a cutting board. Okay, now let's cut a couple of slices to see what it looks like inside and let's give it a taste test. Okay, let's give it a try, salud. It has a beautiful combination of flavors. This fig bread is off the hook. If you enjoyed today's video on making this homemade fig bread, please subscribe to my channel so you can receive all my future videos. Until the next time, hasta luego.